Here you see the beautiful basilica. Now again, we're looking at the Cathedral Basilica of Saints Peter and Paul. Now this was begun in 1846 and uh, it was like a brownstone bronze mother church of the Archdiocese of Philadelphia and eventually it was opened in 1864. That's like almost two decades later after it was started. And this was modeled after the Lombard Church of St. Charles in Rome and uh, is originally designed with outside windows. You can clearly see that. And uh, that was to prevent destruction from the anti-Catholic mobs. Now, the U.S. wasn't really Catholic, and for the longest time, the U.S. and the powers that be in the U.S. were very fearful of the Catholic Church because people who had migrated to the U.S. saw how powerful the Church was in the U.S. So there was a, not a pro-Catholic sentiment so you had the Catholic Church nervous about that. So thus, as I said earlier, it, this church was designed with outside windows. And today, the cathedral welcomes guests and dignitaries from around the world. You can see how beautiful this cathedral looks. We'll take a closer look at the cathedral. And you can even see the area around the cathedral, Logan Park here, and the museum in the background, the museum in the distance. And on the other side of the cathedral, you can see City Hall, all the way in the distance. As we turn and turn and turn, that's City Hall right there. And at the very top, there's a beautiful statue on City Hall. They spent years cleaning the exterior of City Hall because over decades before they had higher pollution standards in the U.S., the soot and grime accumulated on the exterior. So now it is a beautiful white exterior for City Hall. But it's a beautiful area around where they have the Cathedral Basilica also. 